The tubes lead to this spot. Edie, what can you tell us? What are they doing? The tubes are feeding into some kind of superstructure. It is emitting both organic and non-organic energy signatures. Given these readings, it must be massive. Shepard, if my calculations are correct, the superstructure is a Reaper. Not just any Reaper. for our guns. Edie, find me a way to blow this thing to hell. The large tubes injecting the fluid are a weak structural link. Destroying them should cause the supports to collapse and the Reaper to fall. Give us a minute, Edie. We've got to take care of some old friends first. Enemies incoming.
Ground team, status report. It's safe. We are holding, but they keep coming. A quick exit is preferable. Head to the Normandy. Joker, prep the engines. I'm about to overload this place and blow it sky high. Roger that, Commander. Uh, Commander, I've got an incoming signal from the elusive man. He's patching it through. Shepard, you've done the impossible. I'm not finished here yet. This base is ten minutes from extinction. Wait. I have a better option. I'm looking at the schematics ED uploaded. A timed radiation pulse would kill the remaining collectors, but leave the machinery and technology intact. This is our chance, Shepard. They were building a Reaper. That knowledge, that framework could save us. I came here to destroy it, but if you have another idea, I'm listening. We've won a single victory, but we're still at war. This base will give us the technology we need to fight the Reapers. Maybe it's for the best. You have not really defeated the enemy if you adopt their methods. An alien can't appreciate the risk this represents for humanity. Leadership means making sacrifices. You know that better than anyone, Shepard. A threat this big, rules go out the window. If this station can help stop the Reapers, we have to use it. You're making the right choice. Move. In 10 minutes, the reactor core will fire a radiation blast that kills anything on board.
here, Joker. Did the ground team make it? All survivors on board. We're just waiting for you. Human, you've changed nothing. Your species has the attention of those infinitely or greater. That which you know as Reapers are your salvation to destruction.
How bad is it? Bad. We just lost contact with two of our deep space outposts. There's something massive on long-range scanners. Is this what Shepard warned us about? I'd stake my life on it. How long do we have? Not long. I sent word. The fleets are mobilizing. God help us all. Commander. You're not supposed to call me that anymore, James. Not supposed to salute you either. We gotta go. The defense committee wants to see you. Sounds important. What's going on? Couldn't say. Just told me they needed you. Now. Anderson? Admiral? You look good, Shepard. Maybe a little soft around the edges. How are you holding up since being relieved from duty? It's not so bad once you get used to the hot food and soft beds. We'll get it sorted out. What's going on? Why is everyone in such a hurry? Admiral Hackett's mobilizing the fleets. I'm guessing words made it to Alliance Command. Something big's headed our way. The Reapers? We don't know. Not for certain. What else could it be? If I knew that. It's the Reapers, and we're not ready for them, not by a long shot. Tell that to the Defense Committee. Unless we're planning to talk the Reapers to death, the Committee is a waste of time. They're just scared. None of them have seen what you've seen. You faced down a bit. Hell, you spoke to one. They blew the damn thing up. You've seen how they harvest us, what they plan to do to us. You know more about this enemy than anyone. That way they grounded me, took away my ship? You know that's not true. When you blew up the Batarian Relay, hundreds of thousands of Batarians died. It was that or let the Reapers walk through our back door. I know that, Shepard. And so does the Committee. If it wasn't for that, you'd have been court-martialed and left to rot in the brig. That and your good word. Yeah, I trust you, Shepard. And so does the Committee. I'm just a soldier, Anderson. I'm no politician. I don't need you to be either. I just need you to do whatever the hell it takes to help us stop the Reapers. They're expecting you to, Admiral. Good luck in there, Shepard. Anderson? Shepard! Ashley? Lieutenant Commander? How'd it go in there? I can never tell with them. I'm just waiting for orders now. Lieutenant Commander? You hadn't heard? No. I'm a bit out of the loop these days. Sorry, ma'am. Didn't mean to keep you out of the loop. It's not like you learned the Reapers were coming and didn't tell me. True enough. Admiral. Come on. You know the commander? I used to. Admiral Anderson. Shepard. What's the situation? We were hoping you would tell us. The reports coming in are unlike anything we've seen. Whole colonies have gone dark. We've lost contact with everything beyond the Soul Relay. Whatever this is, it's incomprehensibly powerful. 
You brought me here to confirm what you already know. The Reapers are here. Then, how do we stop them? Stop them? This isn't about strategy or tactics. This is about survival. The Reapers are more advanced than we are, more powerful, more intelligent. They don't fear us, and they'll never take pity on us. But there must be some way. Each of us has to be willing to die to save humanity. Anything less, and they've already won. That's it? That's our plan? Admiral, we've lost contact with Luna Base. The moon? They couldn't be that close already. How'd they get past our defenses? Sir, UK headquarters has a visual. from Admiral Hackett. What do we do? The only thing we can. We fight or we die. We should get to the Normandy. Raise the normal. You'll have to contact. We'll meet you at the landing zone. Anderson. Yeah. 